bang us out before we get interrupted by bread. <laughs> interrupted by bread? Interrupted by bread. I want to pan it up just a little bit. Hold on. Okay. I know you can see what's inside of there, but whatever. I'm not looking. Are we going to get interrupted by bread? Probably. Bread's the best interruption, though. Uh, leaving the bread aside for the moment because I know if I make the title like Persona 5 Unboxing, Persona 5 um, Festival Golden Real, <laughs> since you seem to be in town making you mess this up. But if you if I call this video Persona 5 Royal Unboxing, people are going to want to see that. Let's just get this out of the way, then we'll move on to the rest of today. Um, yeah, so for the quarantine, this came in the mail today. And by mail, I mean Amazon delivery. Um, yeah, I haven't seen this. This is the Phantom Thieves version. I've only seen the regular Persona 5 Royal Steelbook because we had that at work. It didn't sell today, by the way. <laughs> Not a single copy was sold, so would you like to do the honors? I have been excited for this version of the game since it was announced. Yeah, and I picked up this cardboard box and I'm like, this is chunky. Yeah, that is, uh, that's massive. Okay. So this, like I said, this is the Phantom Thieves edition. And Vanna will pass it. And <laughs> Persona 5 already was one of my favorite games ever, basically. So I'm really excited for this. I know nothing about it. I've avoided as much in the way of spoilers and everything as I can. I really, I don't even remember the new character, her name. We'll find that out later. But uh, I'm off tomorrow, so the next couple of days are going to be fun because it's night and tomorrow, just this and Animal Crossing. The quarantine's fun, guys, right? At least these two games came out at a good time. Steady now. Steady. Steady. Apparently I needed to cut harder. So if you're asking, if you're going to sit there and ask me, I don't know, uh, ask me what's different in Persona 5 Royal. I haven't found out yet because I don't want to find out yet. I will find out while I play it. But I'm not one of those people who think like, oh, the regular Persona 3 is better than FES, or that the regular Persona 4 is better than Golden. I think every time Atlas has done one of these, the uh, the the plus versions of the game, they've worked out really well. So without any further ado, pushing this aside. I do have a second camera, I haven't used it yet. Not that the glare is going to help any, but uh, that's what we get for lighting this thing, folks. It's a giant glare on the whole thing. As it proceeds to go to focus. Yeah, well, you can tell it's all glossy. Yeah. I really am enjoying this box design. I also forget what I told you this included, so we're about to find <laughs> out together. It says on the side. Well, we're about to find out together. <laughs> Okay, well, here's the game. Here's the Steelbook Edition. This is what I have seen before. I have seen the Steelbook Edition because that came into work about a week ago. Which is... Feel pretty. Oh, that I haven't seen yet. That's awesome. Yeah, it's the back. The front. Right. Honestly, the back's pretty awesome. Yeah, let's, let's get that sucker installed soon. Oh. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> What did you drop? It's a card. It's a flash card. Oh, I got a calling card. It's a lovely calling card. So, By yeah. Atis, because they used the same font for, or the same font color for. Let me see how closely this can focus. They used the same color for the L as the the card, so it says Atis. <laughs> Put the calling card back in there. Deal with. the sleeve for that. Yeah, look. And then there's the Persona 5 Royal soundtrack. That's what you wanted because I own this on iTunes or the program formerly known as iTunes. No, but, this uh, is this looks like from the back that it's just the extra songs they added. Oh okay. So I still uh, so I still own the complete version on the uh, the program formerly known as iTunes. Yep. And that was bread. 
Pardon the bread interruption. <laughs> Alright, high speed mode because our food order is coming soon, so we need to bang this out. Cardboard. Cardboard. Paper. <laughs> the art book. Which we're not going to be looking through on camera because of copyright reasons. If you, I know this is, uh, edition of the uh, game is hard to find, but uh, I'm gonna to open it. it because the the cover wraps around. Yeah, you cover. Mm. Yeah, but uh, sorry, but we're not doing that on the vlog. If you want to see it, you'll have to find it on your own because I know the game's hard to find. But, uh, I have no idea what's in this. The Persona Five Royal Box. this or something? Yep. I think that's what, there's a stand and then there's a ribbon. Oh, okay. Shit, man, there's just ribbons. Yeah, it's like a Venetian carnival mask. So now I'm just gonna hold it up like it's a masquerade. Okay. There's ribbons for this, but I'm way too lazy to figure out how to tie those together right now. Yep. So that's like, we're rushing through this because Sarah's dinner's coming soon. Because Sarah passed all of her classes. Snaps for that because my other hand is tied up holding his mask. Um, I, you know what? It would be funnier if I wore it like this. <laughs> I'm hilarious. What is that? This is Stanford. I'm oh. trying to figure out how it goes together because I don't know if I put the other plexi in backwards, but... Yeah, just probably putting this on my face during the coronavirus thing ruined the entire value of this. Um... This is like... Okay, yeah, cool, it just sits up. We'll put that on display somewhere. Can you show it off real quick one more time? Yeah. We'll put that on display somewhere on the place. I'm not a professional unboxer, don't expect it. Um... But I did get the game. And it's my main thought process for today, so it's what we're going with. Anyway, congratulations on passing all your class. All your class. Many class. <laughs> Let's go get some food. And enjoy the bread that you baked. Yep. We should, we should stop this at some point before it gets crazy big and gigs. Stop it. Weird camera angles, never on my vlog. But, um, yeah. It's getting a little bit late at night. We played... I think I saved it exactly three hours on Persona, which is basically still mostly tutorial. Why am I doing this? I have a little video light right here. Do something with this. Just a little cube light. Do, 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 do. But, uh, yeah, so we played just a little bit of the Persona tonight. Wrong color temperature. That's better. Look at that. This is stupid. This is almost stupid. But, um. But yeah, we played like three or so hours of Persona. And there wasn't too much that's changed right now for the most part. We're just kind of making it through the tutorial again, getting it back to the point where we. I did turn the mic on, right? Wow, this is a train wreck of a vlog again. Um, I did make it to the point where we had. Like, just a little bit to start at Free Roam, and. That's kind of where I decided to cut off for the night. I'm not really going to talk too much about the game. not going to really spoil anything about the game. Because that's not how I roll. I'll talk about it more as I progress through it. Obviously, it's going to take me a while because I've been working so much. The first one is a very long game, and I have no doubts that the remaster is going to become, you know, at least as long as that, probably longer. But yeah, it's still a very good game. It's still a very fun experience. We were still laughing at it, even though we've seen it all before. We, we did fast forward through a little bit of it, just because it, a lot of it is exactly the same. But there are, even for the for, even for the little bit we've come across, there is still some new stuff in there already. But the new stuff will come into play a little bit later. So for now, we're just kind of getting through a lot of the uh, the old stuff, revisiting what we don't remember, having fun with it, and uh, eventually just trying to get to the new stuff because the new stuff will be really, really fun.
that would have worked better if this went completely black.